Alright, and here is my sous vide turkey breast. It's what's for dinner. It's been in here for about three or four hours. Take it out. So I'm going to take the turkey that's already been cooked and I'm going to air. So here it is. Not that pretty, so that's why we're going to put some color in it by air frying it. So I put just uh, mushroom seasoning, some fresh rosemary, and then cooked it in the sous vide for uh, 140 degrees. So just let it cook for three or four hours while I took a nap and did something else. So smoothie sounds fancy, but it's so easy. Before we do any more cooking, I need a drink. So I got some pomegranate from my tree, just froze it. Um, have some Tito's vodka, just a little bit. Vodka cranberry with some La Croix, La Croix lemon, sparkling water for a little bubbly. that I have my drink. I'm going to show you the turkey that can soon be. It's so freaking soft and tender. Here it is. Mm. Like perfectly seasoned, juicy, moist. I highly recommend this method of making turkey breasts. I have the turkey breast in here. I'm going to do a smash cook. So air fry. I'm going to do it for... Alright, turkey is done. And look at that. And this is the other part. So here's the turkey. Just going to slice it. Dinner tonight. Mm. Okay, I have a bag of green beans that I'm going to just air fry it. Just put the whole thing in the basket. Just gonna wing it and add some avocado oil, salt, and pepper. And this is what it looks like, nicely coated. Just gonna throw it into the air fryer. 